My name is Dr Jennifer Cooper and I'm a health data scientist. So my research involves getting a bigger picture of um, the setup of mental health services across Bristol. So the main objective of the research is to look at how um, the pandemic has affected mental health services. So I think it's an important time for this research to take place um, because the pandemic has highlighted uh, existing problems with mental health services and how uh, there's lots of demand and there's not enough capacity um, to go around. And that's kind of uh, contributed to quite a complex picture um, of how mental health services are delivered. Um, so the team working on this uh, project involve researchers from the University of Bristol um, and also uh, modelling and analytics team at the Clinical Commissioning Group. We're also working in partnership with um, Avon and Wiltshire Partnership. I'm Julian Walker, I'm a consultant clinical psychologist and I'm R&D Director for AWP, which is the Mental Health Trust. The thing I hope we get from it is that we get some local insight about how we might need to adapt to the increasing demand in mental health services that but I mean almost any research you look at or any sort of considered opinion suggests that there's going to be an increase in demand. The nature of this research means that we because the information has been collected routinely um, we have uh, the information on people going to their GP practice so that will leave a record um, secondary care services and community services and then we've also got um, from the primary care record um, information on um, demographics. So I'm keen that those large data sets get used well and have the right kind of analysis and research done on them that will allow you to work out how people, patients or service users, us, how we flow through the NHS system and then what happens if you change that system. And th this is really what this is about, is can we look at the pressures that we're anticipating, partly as a result of COVID-19 and the impact that's had on, had on the whole of health, in the hope that we might be able to adjust services or move our resources in a way that responds to that or even anticipates it. We've um, put together a model which can handle all the different um, service levels of the mental health services in Bristol um, and that picture was built up by uh, stakeholder involvement so that involved workshops with uh, providers, clinicians, um, people across the system so we could be get a better picture of what the mental health services look like. You know mental health is about the conversation between a, a service user and a clinician in a difficult moment but running an organisation and running services is about using good academic insight into what's going on to try and improve things. And I really believe in, you know, evidence-based service improvement. And this, is, this would be a good example of that. Um, so we're hoping that the future impact of this research will help to influence uh, local policy so we can improve mental health services.